This video will show you how to get around at least some of these paywalls on websites. This one happens to be the Chicago Tribune, and it just bugged me because I just wanted to read one article. Um, so in this case, I'm clicking on the article, and it's taken me to uh, this new URL where I have this common type of overlay that comes over things. Uh, bugging me to register, log in, subscribe, something. And I, I just don't want to do that. And what I've found is that their web developers have been pretty lazy about, uh, uh, well, to, to have the image of security on their site. And so I think it's perfectly valid to get around that if, if it's all out there in the open, which it is. Specifically, uh, to get around this pay banner, all you need to do is a couple of things. One is I'm going to right click on this banner out in the white somewhere, just out in the open. I'm going to right click. I'm in Chrome. This works the same on most browsers, but I'm in Chrome. I'm going to select inspect element and this is going to bring up in the bottom of the uh, browser, in the bottom of the window, it's going to show me all of the HTML and then CSS and all kinds of stuff. Uh, but specifically, what I have highlighted here uh, that's in gray along the bottom is this main blocking overlay, and it's called uh, Reg Dialog Registration Panel, which appears to be uh, the thing I want to get rid of that's in my way. So I'm going to right click on this guy down in the bottom and then select Delete. And woohoo, it got rid of that first panel that was blocking me. Uh, now I've got this uh, gray overlay that's blocking things. And so I want to find what that guy is and get rid of it. So down in the bottom, I'm going to uh, scroll around here up and it looks like I found what I'm interested in. You can see I've clicked on it in the bottom. Its ID is Reg Overlay. Uh, and what I'm going to do is right click on that guy and click Delete. And that overlay is gone. But notice I still don't have scroll bars here. Uh, I did a little bit of searching. I, I actually went through and did this before and then later decided to do the video. So uh, I did a little bit of searching. And uh, turning off the scroll bars is a trick that anybody can do uh, just with a simple CSS attribute. Um, with uh, the attribute overflow with a value of hidden. And so I'm going to find, I'm going to click on body in this case uh, because I, I know, well, just by highlighting it, I can see that the body div contains everything I'm concerned with. And I do happen to see over here in the CSS on the right hand side down at the bottom, uh, overflow hidden in one of, as one of the CSS attributes. So I'm going to deselect that guy and notice now I have a scroll bar and I can read the remainder of the article. So uh, this is just a short little tip on uh, just stuff you can do with a browser. Um, if any content owners feel like this is breaking any, any sort of legal aspects, they should really put uh, more controls in place to, to stop it because, as we saw, I didn't do anything. I don't have any special permission to the site or anything like that. Uh, it's all just out there in the open. I didn't modify their site. I just modified how it's rendering to me. So uh, there you go. That's a tip for today. Thank you very much.